Good evening. Thank you very much for organizing this. And just in short, in my, in my 90 seconds, I'd just like to mention as follows. What has the Menachem Foundation done for us here in Redondo Beach, California? We've had Baruch Hashem, a very successful preschool with close to 300 children. But unfortunately, once they leave preschool, the families within a year that we invested so much, we rarely see them again. When we started the academy, the upper grades from kindergarten up to first, now we're through fifth grade, this is our fourth year. The challenge was that we live in a community where the schools, the public schools are some of the best in the nation. How do we transform to know and to care to say that Jewish education is so important? For families that did come, for families we approached, the biggest challenge by a lot of them were the aspect of financial, how are they gonna to support to pay for one, let alone two children to go to private school? When the challenge came out to raise this money to give scholarships for children, this transformed the life. It wasn't just the money. It was more than the money. It was to show that other people care about their children. The fact that you were there for them to say, people who don't even know who we are, to say that we care that your child should have a Jewish education, that alone inspired them the importance of it and they were willing to join. And what happened through it? Two things happened. Number one, the Menachem Foundation, and its supporters, thank you to Alan and to Bob that I've been in touch with, have really come through and the money has come in time, which is, which is, which is a, already a fascinating thing. It's not just a promise, but a promise fulfilled. And the money has come and helped us, in, in, enabled us to pay our bills. But it also transformed the lives of these families. It was the children really, the Heshiv Leibavis Abonim, these children transformed the families. Many of the families that came from public school had little or no Jewish education. Today, many of these families, today many, have transformed their homes to kosher homes. Some of the fathers are putting on tefillin every day and are involved here at the center. They literally transform, they have a Yiddish home, a Jewish home, and directly through a first grade, second grade child going to school and learning and being inspired about Yiddishkeit, true authentic Yiddishkeit in a community over here, which is a true desert, has transformed their lives in a, in a tremendous way. And this alone itself, it's not pay pay this. This is not just one child you affected. This has transformed the lives of their families and family families. Because some of the families of Shnei that we brought in last year, they brought in other families. They were so inspired about the education and how the impact, how it was on them, that they brought in other ones. So therefore I say to all the supporters and all the those, those who are here today, Chinuch by far is the most transformative, important Chinuch mitzvah that we have today. There's no question about it. There's many of the mitzvahs, tefillah is, is amazing, it's important, but it's a hit and run, but it transforms internally, the organs internally, and the avir, the whole aspect, is when a child comes home and is excited about Yiddishkeit, excited about learning the Torah, learning Mishnah, learning history about Yiddishkeit, is unbelievable, let alone that we also give a secular, a fantastic secular education that no child should feel left behind because they're having a Jewish education. So thank you to all those who participated. Thank you, Rabbi Shneur, for taking the lead. And I'm very proud and excited to be a part and to be a recipient and also a partner with you in this project. Thank you very much.